Top 10 Unique Animals in the World In this video, we will talk about top 10 unique animals in the world. These strange creatures range from adorable to frightening, and you could try and see them on your next trip assuming you know where to look. Number 10. Southern Cassowary The southern cassowary is much of the time heard well before the bird is seen, with its thundering calls normally given in light of seeing expected peril. The cassowary's enormous size, its huge grayish head protector, cask, and the red wattle dangling from the neck make it simple to recognize the plumes of the body are dark in hair, like the exposed skin of the head and front neck is blue, while the back of the neck is red. The two genders are comparative, however, the female is for the most part bigger than the male, with a taller cask, and is more brilliant in variety. Youthful cassowaries are browner than grown, ups and have more blunt, shaded heads and necks. The chicks are striped yellow and dark, if a cassowary is moved toward, it will by and large hold fast. If the gatecrasher moves excessively close, the bird will extend itself as tall as could be expected, unsettle its otherwise calm disposition, and let out a noisy murmur trying to drive the gatecrasher away. The birds are furnished with very hazardous hooks, and will promptly go after a diligent interloper, even though they generally retreat into the thick rainforest. Number 9. Echidna Echidna, family Tachyglossidae, likewise called barbed insect, eating animal, is any of four types of exceptional egg, laying warm, blooded creatures from Australia, Tasmania, and New Guinea that eats and inhale through an uncovered, cylindrical snout jutting from a vault-molded body canvassed in spines. Echidnas have beady eyes and simple cuts for ears, and toward the finish, of their snouts are two little nostrils and a minuscule mouth. Electroreceptors in the skin of the nose might detect electrical signs delivered by the muscles of invertebrate prey. Echidnas can be dynamic day or night, examining the ground gradually and purposely as they look for prey, yet they will protect themselves from the outrageous early afternoon heat in tunnels or caverns. Like their overall platypus, echidnas have a strangely low yet factor internal heat level of 29, 32 degrees Celsius, 84, 90 degrees Fahrenheit and can't endure more outrageous intensity notwithstanding echidna's outward likeness to hedgehogs. Number 8. Tasmanian Devil Tasmanian demons are the biggest predatory, meat-eating, marsupials on the planet. Tasmanian demons live in Tasmania, a huge island only south of Australia. Tasmania is the main spot where they are seen in nature. Grown, up Tasmanian fiends are ordinarily about the size of a little canine. They have coarse brown or dark fur and a stout appearance that makes them seem to be child bears. Be that as it may, don't allow their adorableness to trick you. They have sharp teeth and solid, strong jaws that can convey one of the most remarkable chomps of any warm, blooded animal on the planet. Tasmanian fiends are predatory, getting through on little prey and habitually devouring currently dead creatures, called carcasses. The most renowned trait of the Tasmanian fallen angel, however, is its lively character. At the point when compromised, a demon will thrust at its aggressor, screech, cry, show some grit, and frequently twirl around and around like the animation Taz. Number 7. Pangolin Pangolins are the main known warm, blooded creature with scales. Their natural surroundings cover portions of Focal and West Africa, India, and Southeast Asia. When compromised by hunters, pangolins roll up into a guarded ball, safeguarded by their protective layer, like covering of keratin scales. Tragically, these insectivores are perhaps the most unlawfully dealt with vertebrates in the world. Their scales are remembered to have restorative abilities in pieces of Asia. And although a worldwide boycott exists on their exchange, the quantities of wild pangolin have dropped radically because of poaching. Number 6. Naked Mole Rat Bear mole rodents are a typical sight in East Africa, where they tunnel into the dry fields of Ethiopia, Somalia, and Kenya. The stripped mole rodent has bewildered researchers for quite a long time, thanks to a progression of surprising organic characteristics. Exposed mole rodents are uncommonly extensive for rodents. Some have been reported at 32 years old. They are likewise impervious to disease and are fit for living in a climate, with simply a little measure of oxygen for quite a long time. 
they are a typical sight in zoos across America. Number 5. Axolotl. This momentous land and water proficient are local to a little series of lakes and channels close to Mexico City. Axolotls, be that as it may, keep their gills and keep living in the water as grown. Ups. Their gills are their most unmistakable quality since they seem to be wispy plumes. Axolotls additionally foster lungs. Even though their primary technique for breathing is through their gills, they periodically utilize their lungs to take in air from the water's surface. Since they live in water their entire lives, they generally have a tail and webbed feet for swimming. Axolotls are normally 23 centimeters 9 inches long. They shift in variety from pinkish to caramel green, and frequently seem, by all accounts, to be grinning as a result of the state of their mouth. Numbering in the thousands and giving a significant food source to the Aztecs, the wild populace of Axolotl is remembered to have dwindled to only a couple of people because of living space misfortune. Axolotls can develop to lengths of 18 inches, and they are described by an interesting arrangement of outer gills alongside the capacity to regrow lost appendages. Number 4. Jabiru Stork The glaring, dull gaze of a 5. Foot, tall stork can be something terrifying for the exhausted voyager. These hypnotizing birds can show regional propensities, as found in a notorious episode that happened at the Belize Zoo. That stork show currently includes a rooftop over the guest, seeing stage, after a jabiru stork once attempted to cut clueless benefactors with its 14-inch long bill. Jabiru storks are local to Focal and South America, where they regularly feed on little vertebrates, fish, and creatures of land and water. Number 3. Koti Mundi There are bunches of charming creatures out there that you most likely need to embrace, or even keep as a pet. The Koti Mundi, additionally called the Kawadi, is one of these creatures so charming. However, most certainly not pet material. Why? There are a lot of reasons, however, the fundamental explanation is that they're genuine gossip, and not inept by any stretch of the imagination. Kawadis are incredibly friendly warm, blooded creatures local to Focal and South America, and have a place with similar family as raccoons and kinkajous. The females are about the size of a house cat, however, the guys can be two times as large, and they have thick, lavish fur and long, improved noses. Their tails are long and stick straight hanging out there, so regardless of weather, you can't see the kawadi's low, thrown body traveling through the grass, you could get a look at the tip of its tail jabbing up. They're dynamic during the day, investing their energy chasing after food and keeping up with their regions. Number 2. Harpy Eagle Striking and delightful. The nag hawk is unbelievable, albeit not many individuals have seen one in their local living space. These extraordinary birds are named after nags, the ruthless, horrendous, flying animals with snared mouths and hooks of Greek folklore. This dim dark flying predator has an extremely particular look, with feathers, on the head fan into a striking peak when the bird feels undermined. A few more modest dark plumes make a facial circle that might concentrate sound waves to further develop the bird's hearing, like owls. Like most birds, the female wench is two times as extensive as the male. The naghawk's legs can be essentially as thick as a little youngster's wrist, and it's bent. Back claws are bigger than mountain bear hooks at 5 inches, 13 centimeters, in length. Number 1. Sparkle Muffin. These new insects are awesome. It's a marvelous find, says arachnologist Damian Elias of the College of California, Berkeley, who was not engaged with the research. The 53 named types of Moratus bugs are tracked down just in Australia, yet photographic artist Jurgen Otto, who has assisted with finding 20 new types of peacock bugs in the beyond four years, accepts that numerous others are simply ready to be depicted. Peacock insects are a sort of hopping bug, connected with normal jumpers you might have seen yourself. Bouncing insects don't wind around luxurious networks to get prey, however, rather chase and tail their prey. How was the video? Did you enjoy it? Post your feedback in our comments section below, and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more updates.